Hey, it's Manson. I'm the founder of Sovereign.ai. Let me walk you through the latest version of Sovereign. So I'll start here with the bulk create hooks feature. And what this allows you to do is allows you to select or uh, upload your own visual hooks and pair that with text hook variations. So I created some visual hooks already here. Uh, here's one with the latte art. Uh, here's one with the female. So it's looking pretty good. Uh, I'll select these three as an example. And you can, of course, upload your own visual hooks if you have them filmed already. Uh, and then what you can do is add your own text hooks like POV uh, text hook one. You can choose your own font. You can up Date the sizing you can even upload your own uh, font as well choose the final export ratio highlight safe areas preview them for real stories or TikTok add your text hook version 1 and then you can also add text hook version 2 put it in a different place if you wanted to add that. So what this will do then is you have two different text hooks and three different visual hooks that will create six different hook, six different new hooks for you to test onto your uh, existing body videos. Okay, so you can hit create, choose the project that you want to upload it into. So that's the first feature I uh, wanted to go over. The second feature is this create asset feature. So the first one helps you bulk create hooks. This uh, video editor helps you create a hook, create a body video, or create a call to action end card. So again, we are starting with the asset library. Uh, you can, let's uh, select this sloth video. I'll play it here. So I have that selected. I'm scrolling down to the step two, which is the video editor. And what you can do now is uh, you can edit the video clip. You can also combine it with another video clip. So I just selected this one. So it's going to load into this video editor. And then let's just combine these two, drag and drop. I'll get rid of this layer. So now this is helping you create a brand new video. Uh, you can add text overlays. So let me just do that. I'll do a, a white color and I'll just do a, a black stroke. You can customize with uh, different fonts or you can even choose from all these different Google fonts. Uh, the times, let's start it here. You can drag the text uh, and then, yeah, let me make a body, body script. Uh, and then what you can do is add the asset name body one, for example, and then choose the building block that you're creating. So you can create a hook or a body video or a call to action. And then finally, you can choose which project to create this new asset into. So that's the second feature I wanted to go over. The third feature, the AI assets feature, which you've sort of seen already, but uh, let me go and just walk through this feature right now. So what you want to do is you want to create a, an image first. So let's, uh, I'm doing this live. Uh, let's generate a cute puppy. Um, drinking coffee. I have no idea what this will look like. But let's just go with it. So it's generating, generating the image. Okay, so let's let's do it. Let's now turn this image 
Let me move my screen. Let me, let's turn this image into a video. You also have AI scripts, so this will take the description of the image itself. Uh, and lets you generate something that way. So I just hit generate video. It'll help you create a five second video from this image. You can also upload your own images. Generating, generating. This will take a couple moments. Okay, here it is. Let's see what this video looks like. All right, he looks pretty happy with the cup of coffee. I'm going to save it. Uh, yeah, so this helps you create AI visual hooks very easily. This will help you create B-roll if you want to uh, go crazy. Uh, that's how you're able to stand out from other competitors. OK, uh, now with all these assets, uh, let me go into uh, project and show you this functionality. So let me go create video ads. And this is the main page where you can do your creative remixing. So I already have some hooks in here. So what you can do is you can upload hooks or create them. And I showed you how to do that. Uh, I'm going to select all these different hooks. And then I'll just select this body video. Uh, select, you can upload call to actions, create them. Uh, you can choose music tracks to iterate on. And when you select these assets, what you're essentially telling Sovereign to do is I want to test nine different text hooks. I want to merge them onto this one body video. And I also want to have three different iterations of music. Now you can export in whatever asset ratio you want. I, we do the standard ones like horizontal, square, uh, vertical, and nine by 16 vertical. So I'm gonna click review. And when you have these assets selected, you can also click the gear icon and adjust the start and end time of all different assets. You can adjust the audio levels too and hit apply. Uh, yeah, you can do that for the body videos. Uh, this last thing is super, super important for performance marketers and creative strategists because you can customize your naming convention and you can get rid of all these. Uh, hook name, body name, call to action name, audio name. This will all pull dynamically from the file name itself. You can customize your separator. You can even add a custom field. So if you work with different creators, you can do creator A. Uh, if this is a new creative testing round, you can do testing round two. Uh, do this separator. You can drag and drop the ordering of your naming convention, which is super, super important. Uh, now you can create video ads. Uh, it'll tell you you're making 27. I'm gonna go to click previous. So when you click the create videos button, it will start to generate and create all those combinations for you with the final ad naming convention. And then finally, you can go here, click download videos, and you can select all the videos to download uh, those 27 videos would have taken like five minutes to create at once. And then you can download all. It'll send you an email with a zip file for you to download. Then you can unzip it, upload into Facebook or TikTok or Apple Oven and start testing. So I hope this was a good walkthrough of the latest version of Sovereign. And I hope that you get value out of it. So thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching.